The calm and quiet of this Saturday afternoon, more of a somber tone, serves as a time to remember the chaos and devastation of July 20th, 2012. It's it's very calming. It's very beautiful. It's very, you know, it takes a, a, an awful, awful experience. And being here just, it helps things. It helps with the healing. Through art, a community remembers the lives lost in a senseless act of violence eight years ago this weekend. I always got bullied for having the same birthday as the day. And so by doing this, it helps me feel that I'm actually helping. Megan Lombard. I'm drawing for Michaela Medique. Uses chalk to honor someone she never met but knows a lot about. Kier Dawkins. I'm drawing for Matt McQueen. Uses art to tell a story of a hero. He actually um, shielded his girlfriend uh, during the shooting. A piece of art to remember every victim. It's hard not to uh, have them on my mind, actually. Uh, like with every stroke that I do, you know, it's kind of, everything symbolizes him. You just hope and pray that someday they can heal. And hopefully things like this help the healing process. Eight years later, the healing continues. In Aurora, I'm Mark Salinger, 9 News. Events are planned all weekend in remembrance of the victims of the theater shooting. Tomorrow, around midnight, people will gather at the memorial in Aurora for a vigil at the time the shooting happened.